Google AdMob disabled? Received email notification from Google AdSense about invalid traffic or invalid activity? In today's video, I'll be sharing you the common reasons why Google terminate your AdMob or AdSense account. Some of the common reasons are 1. Clicking your own ads. It is prohibited to click your own apps or ask people to click your ads that appear on your application. This makes the ad become invalid and misdirected. A match value might decrease due to this. In the policy, it is clear that Google enforces regulations so that publishers do not tell visitors or application users to click on the ads that appear. 2. Using public Wi-Fi to open your AdMob account or use a different IP address to manipulate impression. Impression means displaying an ad page on the application. Every time the ad shows is called one impression. By repeatedly reloading, you will increase your income per thousand page impressions. Performing ad impressions with an incorrect IP address will cause the ad to be misdirected. If a user uses VPN in using the application, an unknown region will be detected on your AdMob report. The third reason? Misconduct of ads placement. Do not put a lot of ads up to cover content. Do not put both banner ads on top and bottom on the same page. This is not recommended by Google. Fourth reason. Click bombs from competitors. Of course, as a publisher, you want a large income from the application that you publish. The more clicks, the greater your income. But what if it turns out that the resulting clicks are so large that they look unnatural during the advertisement stage? Ads that are clicked too much will produce a very large click to ratio CTR. This is not good for calculations in AdSense monthly reports. You may get invalid activity by Google at the end month when publishing an income report. If you notice a lot of clicks suddenly coming from developing countries such as India or Bangladesh, you might have a problem. Nothing can be done if your account has been closed by Google. Recreating an account on the same device using the same internet line will detect multiple accounts because we can only create one AdMob account per developer. We recommend that you be careful to avoid violations that have been clearly stated in the policy that has been determined and keep your account from violating. Finally, as an app developer, it is our responsibility to stay updated on any new notification or policy released by Google AdMob or AdSense. Read through all the Google AdMob policy for more details to avoid or prevent your apps from being banned from Google. Please visit this link to learn more about Google AdMob policies.